Okay, hello techies, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to respond to all your comments that you have done on the videos. I have responded to it uh, via replying on the comment, but I'll try and try to answer in this video. Uh, I'll try whatever possible. Uh, I will try to cover all the comments and if not, I will make every week. I'll try to make videos on whatever comments you're making and try to explain it in a video. So let's go to the screen and let's get started. The recent past, I'm refreshing the comments. So, uh, thanks Krishna for your valuable comments. Can you please create a video of series related to using cloud technology like AWS or GCP? Krishna, please do this. To interesting. Thank you. <laughs> uh, thank you, Sanjay Yadav, uh, for writing so many pieces. But yes, I will try to make videos on any one of the cloud at least. I will start with one of the cloud, whichever is easily accessible. So I will try to create an account and try to uh, make some videos. I have worked on all the three clouds uh, in my uh, projects, but I'll try to make any one of the cloud and then try to make videos on all the different clouds that I have worked on ETL testing, big data testing, how to work on file system, all that. I'll try to create some videos and I have worked on also worked on uh, Python and Spark to automate those kind of testing also. I'll try to make some videos on that topic. Thank you, Sanjay. And again, Sanjay, please keep continue making videos on a skill yes i was also solving uh, multiple complex queries there are a lot of doubts that people start sending so i was working on multiple sql queries also uh, even yesterday i spent around an hour to solve a complex query um, not an hour but less than that but yes uh, i learned a lot so yes i'll try to make some videos on complex sql queries also and solve sql queries also thank you sanjay again and need to Bagel, Bagel. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing a name wrongly. Uh, okay, Neetu, uh, is ETL automation and ETL testing same? No, ETL automation and ETL testing is not the same. When you perform ETL testing, uh, yes, ETL automation can also be considered as ETL testing itself. Uh, what I am trying to say uh, or what uh, clarity you should have is ETL testing. You do it manually when you write uh, the data validation, the ETL validation which you do. If you do that manually, then that is considered as ETL testing and ETL automation is the whole testing process. What whatever you're doing on ETL testing that you try to automate it you try to uh, make uh, uh, write some script write some code uh, using any of the languages mostly use this Python by Spark or Scala Spark and usually Spark is one of the thing or you can use Pandas also uh, to automate your uh, testing of where uh, reading of uh, the data from it can be from database also or file system or anywhere else you read the data and uh, try to uh, compare the data do the validations like null check primary key check all those different kind of testing that is there in ETL testing or ETL validations those validations you perform using the script which you just run the script and all the validation is done so that is what is called as automating the ETL testing itself okay uh, please upload videos as early as possible this is is this uh let's see is this a uh, comment okay did i mention about ETL automation and then the answer the comment was please upload video as early as possible okay <laughs> uh if you're talking about any specific video please mention the video also and uh, yes i'll try to upload videos as early as possible so for now i'm uh, editing the video on my own and i'll try to get a video editor and try to make things faster so that i upload videos faster yes automated uh, etl automation videos yes it is coming soon mostly uh, after second week of april i'll try to make those videos uh, so you have to have some patience i will make etl automation video or uh, i'll try to click so a glimpse of how etl automation can be and then a detailed explanation i'll take it in subsequent videos uh, thank you so much krishna for your videos uh, this was from thank you ETL automation and mohammed dafi mohammed Hafiz, thank you, ETL Automation, 
yes i'll make videos on it lakshmisha uh sanjay yadav again thank you so much krishna for your videos are you working as detail tester or data engineer so currently i'm working as data engineer i started my career uh, as support engineer most of you know and <laughs> then i moved on to etl testing i did a lot of uh, painted testing i did bi testing i did uh, data warehouse testing i worked on unix i worked on aws azure i worked on multiple uh, projects now currently i'm working as a data engineer uh, i'm working in aws okay uh, i am working in aws redshift uh, then emr ec2 and uh, i have done a lot of things so yes uh, okay. uh, then if shita pradhan waiting for your next video in data validation series okay the now next video will be very simple uh, where we are doing file to file validation uh, on unix server itself so i'll i'm already uh, recording the video i will upload the video soon uh, thank you if shita and again sanjay adav hi krishna brother please make few videos to explain how to perform etl validation for cloud source and target as i've already uh, informed yes i'm trying my best i'll try my best to uh, make the videos mostly in the month of april or third or fourth week of april I'll try to make videos and we'll get soon. Mm -hmm. Sanjay Yadav again, nice content brother. Please keep making all such videos for IT testing. Thank you Sanjay for inspiring me, motivating me. Please keep liking the video. Please keep putting your comment and keep sharing the videos with your uh, friends and families and whoever is into data side. So yes, I'll be making more videos. Uh, then, Jiza. Chelsea um um I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing your name wrongly. I love your video. It's clear, concise, and useful. Please share real time in this project. Sure. Thank you for liking my video and loving my videos. And yes, I'll try to make um industry level projects and uh, give me some time. I'm trying to configure the environments to make industry level projects because I have big data environments. I have big data uh, projects um, ready to make videos on. but etl uh, it's difficult to get etl software so i'm trying to make some industry level projects uh, we using the etl uh, tools util etl software so uh, sorry for the delay but i'll try my best to make videos on that okay uh, ravi dubey uh, sir main 2015 ka pass out hu aur uske baad um, government job ki preparation ki aur ab career gap aa gaya hai क्या मैं आई टी फील्ड में आ सकता हूँ यस जरूर रवि आप आई टी फील्ड में आ सकते हैं बहुत बहुत ज़्यादा ही आसान है एंड मिस्टर ठाकुर ने भी रिप्लाई किया भाई एटिल टेस्टिंग सीखो मैं भी वही लगा हूँ स्टार्ट करने यस एटिल टेस्टिंग इज़ वेरी सिंपल एस के एल सीखना है थोड़ा एटीएल टूल सीखना है डेटा वायरस के कॉन्सेप्ट सीखने हैं बहुत आसान है आ सकते हो अगर आप डिटेल में मेरे साथ बात करना चाहते हो सॉरी आई एम स्पीकिंग इन सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टॉक टू मी इन डिटेल अबाउट योर करियर अबाउट वॉट ऑल हैपन एंड सो दैट आई कैन गाइड यू हाउ मच टाइम इज ऑलरेडी वेस्टेड सो आई वुड रिक्वेस्ट यू टू um basically uh have a one on session or maybe uh, send me messages on instagram or linkedin connect to me there and i will try to uh, help you uh, whatever possible uh, from my side okay uh, so i am already connected on linkedin yes sir abhi aap mere ko message kar do please send me a message on linkedin or instagram anywhere wherever you are connected to me please send me a message i will uh, try to help you understand your situation and then try to help you then aptil lover aptil aptil lover okay uh, please tell me which course to buy for automation testing who will give 100% placement assistance uh, sorry aptil uh, uh, there is no 100% placement guarantee uh, if anybody is uh, providing you 100% guarantee then it's a scam don't go into don't join those courses they can assist you they can help you they can support you they can guide you they can give you uh, all the guidance that is required they can show you the path you have to walk the path because it is very difficult uh, to get job i understand but uh, if you, you are dedicated working dedicated efforts hard work uh, shortly you will get a it job that is for sure uh, but uh, there is no such hard and fast 100% placement कहीं भी नहीं होता है दैट इज नो हंड्रेड परसेंट प्लेसमेंट इफ हंड्रेड स्टूडेंट्स आर स्टडिंग हार्डली थर्टी फोर्टी स्टूडेंट्स ओनली गेट इफ दे आर वेरी डेडिकेटेड लाइक फ्रेशर्स मोस्टली दो आर जस्ट इन फोर्थ ईयर और गेटिंग पास आउट ऑफ फोर्थ ईयर दे मोस्टली गेट इजिली बिकॉज एटी नाइनटी परसेंट आर फोकस्ड एंड डेडिकेटेड इन लर्निंग बट इफ यू हैव अ गैप दैन द डेडिकेशन एंड एफर्ट इज वेरी मच रिक्वायर्ड टू गेट अ जॉब एंड नो बडी विल प्रोवाइड हंड्रेड परसेंट प्लेसमेंट दैट इज वेरी क्लियर 
okay and if somebody is providing please don't join that, those courses you will regret please uh, follow uh, what i'm saying i have gone through this i have wasted a lot of money please don't do that okay nice interaction with you uh, rishabh jain official yeah. nice interaction with you brother looking forward for such okay i haven't replied uh, okay uh, i wish i did a podcast with rishab so he has posted nice interaction with him yes uh, the video is in his channel also and in my channel i have edited the video little better so that's why i have posted in my channel as well uh, okay thank you rishab uh, if you are watching this video and uh, devendra devendra agnihotri devendra bhaiya main om आगरा स्टेशन में मिला था ना यस ओम मुझे याद है आप आगरा स्टेशन में मिले थे मैं गोवर्धन से आई वाज ट्रैवलिंग फ्रॉम गोवर्धन टू बैंगलोर बैक एंड देन विच इज वृंदावन एंड गोवर्धन फ्रॉम उत्तर प्रदेश टू बैक सो आई बोर्डेड माय ट्रेन एट आगरा यस ओम इफ यू आर वाचिंग दिस वीडियो आई थैंक्स एंड सी यू सोन एंड नेक्स्ट अलंग ट्राई <laughs> एंड every table has 100 columns also 100 to 100 that is uh, uh, roughly 10000 checks that you have to do but you don't have to do manually you can write a stored procedure and uh, this can be easily done uh, i'll try to make a video on that also how to write stored procedure although even i don't know a detail of stored procedure i have written some of them i have learned some of them but i'll try to make video on stored procedures how to do uh, how to write a dynamic query uh, dynamic query and uh, do the validations for uh, all the columns in that particular table also and all the tables in that particular database all the uh, tables in that particular schema or database i'll try to make a video on that so i am testing both of both the scenarios i am testing in oracle also i am testing in uh, mysql also whichever uh, i get it through uh, because i am not getting a lot of time to um, write these uh, but i am trying my best uh, in my recent project also i was working on um, uh, amazon redshift so there also i am trying to do so as i achieve that and as that is uh, accomplished then i'll try on mysql and also on uh, oracle and whichever uh, comes out to good uh, that i'll try to make video and uh, surely our uh, the video should come soon uh guru guriya guriya kumari answer is not up to the point for some question but thanks uh so uh, uh this is a live session and i cannot um, give all the details of everything on a public forum so uh, all the answer are not very clear and if you have any specific question uh, which uh, i should answer according to your situation according to your scenario then you can please uh, connect me on linkedin and instagram and i will try to help you uh, as much as possible key takeaways for uh, this is private movie uh, sorry i don't have your name but private movie is key takeaways for uh, quick navigation a video discusses the difference between a data engineer and data tester uh, 
okay thank you uh, for posting this and made from harappa ai sure i'll try this harappa ai and uh, see uh, if i can make my timelines using uh, this tool uh, and if this is free for sure i will try it and thank you uh, for posting this message capture 99 uh, and private movie if you are watching this video please uh, do ping me on uh, linkedin and instagram i'll try to discuss this with uh, you and get more insight of this uh, capture 99 subscribed thank you capture 99 uh, sorry your name is not there uh, thank you for subscribing the channel and uh, now please watch all the videos and you will also like it Ipshita uh, Pradhan, please share how to do performance testing in ETL. So I haven't done a lot of performance testing in ETL, uh, but uh, I will try to make some videos, whatever uh, possible, whatever I have done. For that, I'll try to some, make some videos on that. Uh, Nikhil Kumar, if count didn't match, then what to do as ETL tester? Uh, yes. So the expectation is, uh, so here there can be two scenarios where if the count should match say for example if all the if it is a dimension table all the data from source to come uh, so should come to the target then obviously uh the date uh, the count should match but if the count is not matching uh, so yes it is a defect in our scenario where uh, it is uh, the source data we are uh, doing transformation and then loading is a factable then there obviously kind will not match but you have to tweak the query of the source query according to the expectation for, for the target so the count should match. So basically your query should be good enough, uh, which makes it as uh, the count should match. If the count is not matching, it is a defect. Yes, it is a defect. But your query should be uh, technically right. So to express that uh, the count should match is matching. Uh, Nikhil Kumar, uh, thank you for commenting and I hope uh, you have your answer. And Amal, Amal Peters, kindly share stage by stage what are the validations with transformation like source to landing, then staging and target and warehouse. Okay, uh, I'll try to make a video on um, from source to staging, staging to target, target to BI. So different. Uh, phases also i'll try to make some videos uh, but the validation mostly remains the same uh, but still if you are interested uh, do let me know in this comment and i'll try to make a video on detail video on every phase of the testing and thank you for commenting uh, Shades, cv keep it up thanks thank you Shades. yes i will keep it up and make amazing videos it's me roi Keep it up, bro. Thank you, bro, for commenting. And yes, I will make more lovely videos. Surya Kant Kumar, Surya Kant Kumar, share practical work. I want to learn work. I am not able to clear interview testing. I am sorry, Surya Kant. You are not able to clear interviews. I'll try my best to make more videos so that you have more clarity and you crack the interview fast. Thank you. Okay, here, uh, Alag, Alangan. Do la Sandeep. Okay, Sandeep, uh, you also message yes, I will try my best to make videos and give you a like here. So Rekan Kumar, yes, thank you. Thank you for giving a heart. <laughs> so Rekan Kumar, uh, please sir, share real-time projects, industry, company projects, work, agile sprint work. Okay, uh, that's a lot of things. <laughs> yes, I will try to make a project as well. And uh, if you guys are not in, uh, not uh, aware of agile and sprint, how it works, then do let me know in this comment. I'll try to make a video on how the agile, how the sprint, how the scrum or the Kanban model, how the, these different models work. Uh, again, I'm not a scrum master or somebody to give explanation on this, but still how it works, how it is for an engineer to face it and how it works in a real time so that at least i can explain with my experience of attending um, so many different meetings and attending uh, being part of uh, multiple projects like so many projects with the different countries different uh, companies different clients so with that experience i'll try to explain thank you for commenting user qk uh, hi krishna i am from odisha i have watched your postcard with techniques ninja very inspiring i would like to connect to you i am a qa manual tester i need some career advice if you can help me out i would be very grateful to you thank you thank you user qa uh, 
thank you and very nice you're from odisha uh, i know i'm from odisha so uh, thank you for watching the my um, podcast technical sunaja uh, and nice that you are inspired please connect to me on the instagram or uh, linkedin i'll try to help you as much as possible from my side or whatever is possible i'll try to do that and thank you for commenting uh, shuhas su shuhas bandal bandal okay sorry if i'm not pronouncing your name correct shuhas uh, hi krishna i'm from a bpo background learning testing from a local institute in pune 30 plus age want to know how is the life of a tester uh, challenges difficulties and the first side of this role do you need to do continuous learning like study every day after office and all how is it like okay so has uh, thank you for commenting and uh, um if you have moved to it then very good if you have not moved to it and if you are 30 plus and uh, please watch my recent podcast also uh, i have uploaded in this channel please watch those videos and um, mostly it should help you uh, i have explained about my own journey and uh, also if you need more guidance please connect to me on uh, linkedin or instagram and uh, i'll try my best to help you as much as possible from my side and in it to answer your question in it are uh, Uh, there are two phases where uh, there are two uh, different ways uh, if you see it as uh, you don't want to learn every day then uh, there will be a time uh, so not a uh, not a very short time but in 5 to 6 years of time uh, your uh, knowledge will be absolute as the knowledge and the technologies are growing your knowledge will become absolute but uh, if you keep learning uh, so it's not that every day you have to learn you can set an hour uh, maybe every week two hours you can spend to learn latest technologies or something whatever is going on uh, because uh, that's how you will be um, uh, basically updated to the latest technologies the latest trends that is coming into it so yes learning is required uh, if you get into any field any sector learning is required it's not that you learn one thing and uh, so everything that is there in the market or will become absolute at some point in time if you remember the std isd boots now you will not find std isd boots um, if you would have seen uh, internet cafes were there where uh, used to go pay some money for an hour for half an hour but do you think uh, internet cafes are still working today i don't think it will be uh, if 100% go to market like i just think one or two percent is still existing or everything else is dead because of geo because of so much internet for because everybody has a wifi in their house so uh, in any field you go uh, things will get absolute at a certain point in time so in it also uh, your knowledge should not get absolute so your knowledge should keep growing so that is why you have to learn it's not that every day you have to learn but at least every month you should learn Uh, every month or every week you should set some time to learn and it's not always you have to learn technical things but if you learn uh, management level of things so you can get into management also it's not that you have to stick to technical things but the choice is always yours you want to be a technical guy or you want to be a management guy so the choice will always be with you so this thank you for replying again sql yes i'll make more excel videos and this was anyway sql part 3 so i have uploaded many videos at least some part 10 videos i have uploaded and um, many more videos are also there in hindi channel also please do subscribe to the hindi channel also a nice content helping precious like me so this thank you <laughs> glad to hear that uh, that you are liking the uh, sql content i will make more sql contents where i solve uh, real time uh, problems and real time uh, interview questions also okay uh, i feel uh, uh, the video has become very long so let me take uh, a break here and uh, read the comments in the next part of this video i'll try to make videos or uh, reading the comment and answering your questions every week i'll try my best uh, please 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 keep populating the comment content uh, comments uh, with whatever questions you have please keep populating it and um, i'll try my best to make more videos uh, Uh, content and uh, try to answer all your questions using videos also and also writing uh, replying to your comments and thank you for watching this video if you like my video please do uh, subscribe to the channel and also please like the video and also uh, uh, please uh, uh, no uh, uh, there is a link in the description which will uh, help you uh, join my whatsapp and telegram channel please do that so that it will help you to 
uh, get connected to me closely if there is anything that is coming out if there is any update i'll give my first updates at telegram and whatsapp and then it comes to any public forum so please do join the telegram and whatsapp channel and uh, there also i might give some offers on any of the product that i'm launching it can be a course or it can be a one on session or anything that comes up will be first uh, uploaded and given priority to my whatsapp and telegram channels and thank you for watching with this video and see you in the next video bye bye